Good day, you are welcome to GRF Engineering Channel. Today we are going to talk on how to calculate the quantity of reinforcement to complete a drainage project. The diagram here shows the concrete drainage. This is the concrete drainage. We have the wall, we have the base and the other wall. The thickness of the wall is 0 0.15 and the thickness of the base is 0 0.1 meter, which the other one is 0 0.152. And we have the reinforcement position at the middle of the drainage. This is the reinforcement diagram. So let's treat the concrete diagram. We have the in to end of the drainage to be 0 0.6 meter and the how to out. In addition with the drainage, the drainage work, the how to out will be 0 0.9 meter. Why the height is 0 0.7 from the top of the drainage to the bottom of the base so to get the specification of the reinforcement to be used we have the width into in width is 0 0.6 in which the iron will position at the middle of the wall and the wall is 0 0.15 the middle will be 0 0.075 and the 0 0.075 to the other side so that means we are having 0 0.075 at this side and 0 0.075 at the other end in which the width of the reinforcement will be 0 0.6 plus 0 0.075 plus 0 0.075 which will give us 0 0.75 meters and the height we have 0 0.6 at this end 0 0.6 the height of the drainage from from the base is 0 0.6 meter and we have the base which is 0 0.1 meter so that should be 0 0.7 but from here now, we are not going to do 0 0.7 because of the filling of the mortar to cover the iron and the other hand too, so that the iron will be on the mortar. It will not be touching the ground. So that means 0 0.05 will be cut short at the top and 0 0.05 will be cut short at the hand too. That will give us 0 0.6 meters instead of 0 0.7 that we get here from the top to the base so this is 0 0.6 meter so the diagram for the reinforcement we have 0 0.6 meter from this top to the bottom and 0 0.75 meter from this end to the other end 0 0.6 meter here and we have the so the specification for the for the reinforcement now we have main bar and distribution bar the main bar is this U bar and the distribution bar is the other one that, that is used to attach the U bars. Why the spacing is 0 0.3 meter and the distribution bar spacing is 0 0.2 meters. And, and the iron to be used for the main bar is Y12 and distribution bar will be Y10 for this uh, specification for this project. So now we are to go into the calculation. So we we'll calculate the uh, the length of the, the member to be used. We have 0 0.6, which is 0 0.6 meter plus 0 0.75 meter plus 0 0.6 meter. So that should give us 0 0.6 plus. 0 0.75 plus 0 0.6 that will be giving us 1.95 meter and the length of an ion is 12 meter so that means for this member we are going to, to to have this is 12 meter for the length of an ion divided by 1.95 meter that means we are getting that should be 6 divided by 1.95. That means we are getting 6 members in one length. So, and for the distribution bars, we are using the full length for distribution bar. And the Y10 length is 12 meter too. So, this is for Y12 member and distribution bar Y10. We have a full length is 12 meter so we are using the complete 12 meter 
for the reinforcement so the settings of the reinforcement now now we are getting so for this video we are calculating for a hundred meter one a hundred meters length of drainage so for the sake of this uh, video we are calculating for a hundred meter length of the drainage so to complete a hundred meter length of the drainage we are having a wide sphere we are getting six meters six members in one length of and higher so we are going to calculate for 100 meters that means we are going to use 100 meters divided by the spacing the spacing of the member So that will give us 100 meters divided by the spacing of the member is 0 0.3, 0 0.3 meters. That will give us 100 divided by 0 0.3. It should now be equal to 333.33 pieces. So plus one, the first one you use to start the work, plus one. That will give us 334 pieces. Three hundred and thirty-four pieces for the main bar. And for the distribution bar, we have this is one, the spacing is 0.2. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That means we are getting 10 distribution bar to be attached for one basket of the reinforced drainage reinforcement so for this one now and we are having for a ton of white 12 a ton of white 12 we are having 93 length of iron and a ton of Y10, we are having 133 length of iron. So that means for a basket, and a basket is 12 meter, to get the number of U's to be used in a basket, we have 333 U's to be used, 333 cut length. This is of cut length of main bars. So we are having six cut length of the main bars inside one length of the iron. So that means for hundred meters that we are we will need three hundred and thirty-four pieces. To get the number of length, we will calculate it by having 334 divided by 6 that we are having in one length. Divided by 6, that will give us 334 divided by 6. That will be 55.67 and approximately to 56 length. Now, 56 length of Y12. For the main bar and for the distribution bar for one length we are having one two three four five six seven eight nine ten for one basket we are having 10 lengths of distribution bar and for a hundred meters that means we will be dividing 100 meters by the length of the higher which is 12 meter but for the sake of the adjoining of the baskets that means we'll be subtracting the spacing to join the basket which is 0 0.3 the spacing for the member 0 0.3 meter will be subtracting it from the length of the iron that means we'll be using 11.7 meters to divide the 100 meters 100 divided by 11.7 meters that will be giving us 8.5 five baskets
that means each 12 12 lengths of the of the of the basket it will be giving us 8.55 basket so for that 8.55 basket multiply by to get the length of the y12 we'll be getting in the one in in the 8.55 basket we'll be multiplying the number of lengths of y12 we are getting in one basket which is 12 which is 10 lengths 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 multiply by 10 that will give us 85.5 lengths 85.5 lengths so which means 85.5 length will be 85.5 length of y12 of y10 sorry y10 which is not up to a ton of y10 and we are getting for the member we are getting 55.67 approximately 56 length of y12 which is not even up to a ton again so to get the number of ton we'll be dividing the number of lengths we get by the, uh, the number of lengths in a ton for y12 y12 we have 56 divided by 93 and for y10 we be having 85.5 divided by 133 which will give us 56 divided by 93 0.6 tons and we have 85.5 divided by 133 which give us almost the same thing 0.6 tons so that is how you calculate for the quantity of reinforcement to complete a hundred meter for this specification drainage of a project so subscribe to my channel jrf engineering to see the notification for more videos like this in pertaining to engineering road engineering building engineering pertaining to any aspect of engineering thanks for watching subscribe to my channel bye